Good morning guys, we are taking you to Ikea today. There's some things planned for the afternoon, but we wanted to zip down here, run through, check it out. If it looks like you want to spend more time in here, we can just come back later. Okay. Yeah. I just want to look around, it's been years, like what, seven years since I've been yeah. Rooster picture in black and white. Have you ever seen it? <laughs> oh, fuzzy right stuff. underneath the fuzzy thing. So you're gonna yeah. get. So you're not gonna get that. No, I'm not. Cause I made my own. Remember when I did the DIY with you guys on how to like shape the fabric and it's a really easy thing to make on your own. I really like all these, all the cubes, and some of them have drawers. That's a neat setup. You like that better than the one you have? I do. Let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, two, four. Plus the little drawers. It's really handy. Wow. Is it lighter too? It's lighter. I like the glass shelves too. You can imagine like being able to set your handbags in there or shoes or something, you know, to keep them all dust free. That would be really nice. Okay, I'm keeping this chair in mind. Let me write it down. And swivel. If uh, you want, we can maybe just check it in as luggage instead of getting a VHX box. Okay. I really like the look of this kitchen. All stainless steel, white, very clean. The white stools. Tell me about it. Whitewash floors, yeah. all white display, and keep. I keep... Do like the white, the white doors. Yeah. You like a bear rug? No. no <laughs> I can remove that. Yeah. But I like all the lights and it's clean, compact. It kind of looks like a small apartment. Yeah. Oh no, here's the section that Michael would like. He loves these big, like, cutting block sort of islands, I guess. Let's see. Not that one. That one's a little too dark. He always likes stuff lighter, too, so. Alright, we're in the chairs section here. This is a popular one that I think I've seen on YouTube a lot. Only $79. It has a little bit of flex, so it's not super stiff, even though it is still, you know, like the hard loose side or whatever. Hard acrylic. But I think I'm really leaning towards um, like a white upholstered one. They have a great selection of bar stools here too. Oh my goodness. I really like this style here. And then they have some upholstered ones too, if you like more cushy. And then this one's really neat too. I like the modern look of that. So what's the name of this? This is the Glen. And then this one is, oh, what's the name of that one? This little cable knit throw. How cute is that? Oh my goodness. What is the name of that one? Ursula. Synthetic sheep skin. You made one already. Yeah, yeah. I did DIY. One of those, those. Uh, above the bed, keep the mosquitoes out. You want one of those, the big flowing? Yeah, I get one for the caterpillars. The, for the caterpillars? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> How romantic. Isn't that? Wake up in the middle of the night with a net over you. Okay, here's that cable net throw that we found earlier, Ursula. This one is, I found the price on it finally. This is $29.99, so $30. This is really a pivotal moment here. I have never seen the famous Malm in person, but here it is. I see everyone oh, on YouTube has it, yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's like... Well, it has a drawer too? It has a drawer, uh, yeah. You know what? It's yeah. smaller than I thought. It's definitely yeah. smaller, yeah. I totally thought it was much bigger, but now that I'm here in person, it's really not that big. It's pretty tiny. Nice full length drawer though, okay. It is very nice and it has the glass top. Oh, uh -huh. So I'm trying to picture myself like coming home and sitting down at it while Oh, you're thinking for the work desk? Or well, a... anything. Oh, no, wow. It is much more narrow than my current work desk. Yeah. So it wouldn't take up much space in the living room. Yeah. So but where would you, that. I mean, the computer, think about the computer comes out to about, yeah. <laughs> and would you, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. Look, here's the six drawer mom chest. Oh, yeah, I like that. The drawers are Where nice and smooth, huh? Plus this uh, hinge top mirror. Yeah. Okay. It's nice, it's nice designs. I yeah. like the designs. Okay, that was the upper floor that we covered with all the furniture, and now we're downstairs looking at all the housewares. 
Oh, look at that, yeah. Look at this guinea pig one. Oh, that is cute. A little single serving. I really like these containers with the white lids. Oh, that would be super handy if you wanted to do like, you know, like pre-made meals for yourself for the week. Okay, this section definitely caught my attention in the bathroom section here. All the bathroom goods. Look at all that bamboo and these. Ooh, ooh, I love these, these little baskets. Oh! Oh my goodness, and there's more inside. It's like the babushka. The thing. babushka. So you get a set of three, three. for how much? $10. Those and you can are put the really cobra cute. In Where it. are they made? Made in food. Vietnam. Look at the little bamboo soap dispenser. Bathroom dish set. That's something something I'm gonna keep in mind. And then let's see if Michael has found anything. Oh, we got that's hampers. Nice. That's a neat neat design though. Plus it's that uh, fragrant grass, whatever it is. Do you like it? Does it smell good? Yes. Yeah, it smells good. Yeah, I like the seagrass stuff too. It looks like a almost like a banana fiber or something. What is this? Oh palm leaf. Yeah, palm coconut. These are really cool boxes here. They do fold down. I probably won't try to get one home with me, but they're really neat. I like that rugged design. That one's really cool. So what's the name on that? Okay. Kodabo. Just so I can remember. This mirror has a nice clean look to it. Nice style. Like if you had a walk-in closet or something, it'd be really easy to make it like very boutique style with everything that you have access to at Ikea. Well, their mirrors are really affordable here, too. Look at the super cute chandeliers. These are quite nice. I like the little the natural papery look. We're going up to Placerville. There's REI. That's where I used to work. One of my jobs here, anyway. There's Costco up there. So we'll go to Costco maybe on the way back down? Yeah, I want to stop in there. We're in Placerville and we are going to be doing uh, some floral arrangements for the wedding. So I don't know if I'm going to be filming in here or not, but I figured I would at least take you up here with me and, you know, check out the town. Looks like them right there. Well, this town uh, has changed a little bit, like everywhere else that we've been, but uh, like this newsstand has been here forever. That. Uh, hardware store and a few other places still the same but yeah a lot of it's changed a lot. The quaint little town, you know, Bell Tower, I think they ring that when there's fires or something. Oh. This one says it's been there 1856, I don't know. Wow. Oh, Cosmic Cafe. Cosmic Cafe. In Placerville. And this is an old mining building. The mine shop used to go in there like 100 feet. Oh, uh, so they have it closed right now. Look at that okay. Are you hungry? Nah. It's an old building. So the mine goes back behind that building. Yeah, it goes all the way into that um, mountain back there. Okay. Anything else in Placerville? Nah, I can't think of it. Portia Flats, they've been there a long time. Okay, we're still in Placerville. We're just going to stop at the grocery store. We're going to go Wrigley's. Go get some snacks and then head back down to Sacramento, Roseville, or yes. what, Granite, Granite Bay. Okay, so for snacks we have guacamole again. I'm trying a different kind this time. What is this one? Good foods? Pineapple. Hopefully. Is that one better? It's uh, pineapple-y, yeah. Okay. Pico de gallo. Pico de gallo again, raspberries, which we'll rinse off. And then um, just a couple of these fruit cups, no sugar added. And then I had to try these cocoa runes because I like coconuts. And they're gluten-free, vegan, and they're only sweetened with maple syrup. And then a couple of bananas. And then the vanilla chai from Old House. And then tortilla chips. Okay, we're at the Roseville Galleria. Okay, here's 100% pure. This is my first time coming into one. Try. 100% pure. They give you that little bag. Yeah, isn't that cute? It's like a little guinea pig tote. <laughs> Let's see. Did you get the Maui one? No, I didn't. Really? Want me to? No. 
Trader Joe. Vegan. Chickenless wraps. With barbecue dipping sauce. Oh my goodness. Broke the mouth. Those are the best. <laughs> We're having breakfast at uh, Old Town Sock. Fox and Goose. Fox and Goose, okay. So this is like a tofu scramble, curry, vegan. vegan fruit. Michael's having side of potatoes. Looks good, looks good. Is it good? Mm -hmm. And then this is a soy chai.